also just thinking about something how the more anxious I get the more likely I am to not actually do anything to curb that anxiety it's like anxiety begets anxiety I don't even know if anxiety is the word but it feels like that's what it is this paralyzing type of feeling that I can't do anything but I know there's so much that I have to do and when thinking about doing all that stuff I have ideas on how to do it but I just don't do it I don't start and even though I know that if I started a year ago on the same thing that I'm talking about, I'd be in such a better position. So what's stopping me from starting now to be in a better position a year from now? Nothing. It's a, it's a ridiculous question. Nothing except this. This is stopping me. It's like not working in my best interest even though it is housed in the thing that is working for its best interest. So it's a it's an interesting conundrum. You know, I replaced I had such anxiety from from one method that I thought would be the end of you know, making making money and and seeing myself in a better financial position. But I got so anxious around just doing that that I decided to drop it. But now I'm in a position of, oh my God, I'm so anxious because it feels like I have nothing or the thing that is my second best option is in my head built up so much that it's going to take so freaking long to do and I don't even start like make it make sense you know it doesn't it doesn't make sense at all and that's what's frustrating because it doesn't make sense and I'm the type of guy that wants things to make sense I love making sense of things and when it's in my own head that doesn't make sense that makes me even more upset and anxious maybe anxious is the word of the day so I don't know um, yeah can't think of anything else to say so I'm gonna end it here but um, thanks for listening and watching peace